Technology has been part of art since the beginning of art, whether it was you know, the advent of charcoal to draw on a cave wall or paints. In this case, we're using um, computers and computer systems and data and bits and bytes. But it's really, and from my perspective, it's no different than paint. Come into here. This is a new project, and it's really about combining the old and the new. It's going to be five different giant um, lights, and they use aluminum frames and old Edison bulbs. And in the bulbs are small LEDs that we can project video into. Jen Lewin is an interactive new media artist. She does create computer-mediated artworks that involve the viewer. She works with sound and light and encouraging the viewer to move around and activate parts of the artwork. These are interactive platforms that are part of my pool sculpture. And they're meant to be jumped on and played on and you step on them and they light up and project and send video messages to the other platforms and you can create beautiful swirls of light and color. You know, what is art? What is technology? What is craft? That's an elusive question. Yeah, I think if you go back to the most ancient roots of art, whether you go back to cave paintings, which existed in many different parts of the world, it was about the image that might have been represented, but it was also about the space and the light in which you were perceiving those images. It's not surprising that this idea of interactive art with large groups of people is, is happening at a time when there's so much social media. If you look at the internet, suddenly there's all these examples of the web being used to connect groups of people and to bring them together. And in my work, I'm trying to do the same thing. I'm trying to bring 100 people together into a space to play with the sculpture in a much more networked and connected way. Art, architecture, and technologies of light, technologies of construction, etc., were combined to create total environments. So I think a lot of new media artists are returning to that idea.